Welcome to another episode of The Drop, the weekly show that lets you know the hottest games coming out across PlayStation, Xbox, Switch, and PC. And this week, MLB The Show is coming up to bat for 2021, a very exciting year for the annual baseball franchise as it makes its way to Xbox for the first time. But without further ado, let's go ahead and check out this week's hottest video game releases. MLB The Show 21 comes to PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, Xbox Series X, S, and the Xbox One this week. Experience faster, deeper, and more intense moment-to-moment -moment match action on the field with a variety of game modes for all you rookie players and returning seasoned vets. Lead your ball player to row to the show and Diamond Dynasty glory as a two-way star. Enjoy updates to franchise and March to October modes, which empower you to better make decisions for the future of your club. The legends live on in the show. Play as your favorite MLB legends like Jackie Robinson, Willie Mays, Ken Griffey Jr., Mickey Mantle, Cy Young, and Babe Ruth in MLB The Show 21. New MLB legends will also be joining soon, so stay tuned. Welcome to the show, Xbox! It's time to celebrate! Not only is the show available on Xbox consoles for the first time, but you can now enjoy cross-platform and cross-gen play with PlayStation users, get ready to own your rivals, and of course there is an entire new slew of next-generation features. There are new intro presentations, smooth 60fps gameplay, more detailed stadiums and environments, immersive 3D audio and game-changing haptic feedback on PlayStation 5 systems, and of course, as mentioned previously, cross-platform progression and completion. I also want to mention this game is coming on day one to Xbox Game Pass, a very impressive addition to the lineup for Microsoft's game subscription service. So no matter where you play, it's always going to be a good time with MLB The Show, which is one of the biggest and best sports franchises out there, and it's back for 2021, coming to PlayStation and Xbox later this week. MotoGP 21 comes to PlayStation, Xbox, and Nintendo Switch. Take your place on the starting grid and get ready for the most realistic and immersive MotoGP video game ever. Live the 2021 season at its fullest with the classes MotoGP, Moto2, and Moto3. Live the most authentic and immersive two wheels racing experience with more than 120 official riders, over 20 tracks, and new and improved features for an unprecedented level of realism. And for the first time, the long lap penalty. Relive the history of MotoGP with more than 40 historic riders and their iconic bikes. Plan your game. Take full control over your managerial career. Joining an official team or creating a brand new one, it's up to you. Then select your staff. A team of professionals will assist you throughout the season and your career, helping you to take crucial decisions like the choice of the best contract and the development of your bike. And once you get to the highest classes, build your own junior team handling every aspect. Every detail is under control. When you can control and manage every aspect of the race, every decision matters. Keep tabs on the level of fuel, the brakes temperature, and the tire wear. Take crucial choices based on your riding style and the conditions of the race. Winning with style. Whether it is the way you ride or the way you look, style is key in MotoGP 21. Show them who you really are. Customize helmets, suits, stickers, racing number, and livery with five incredible graphics editors. And impress everyone with your riding style too. Also, our revolutionary neural AI system, based on machine learning, is back with significant improvements. Get ready to discover new faces of Anna in the most exciting races ever. Take the fun to a whole new level, challenging your friends online, or create your own events with the race director mode, enjoying a smooth and lag-free experience thanks to our dedicated servers. MotoGP continues to be one of the best road racing games out there for those that are fans of the bike racing experience, so if you want to dive in for the 2021 season, the game is coming out across platforms this week. Near Replicant comes to PS4, Xbox One, and PC this week, and I do want to make this very clear, just so that we're all on the same page. The game's official title is Near Replicant version 1.22474487139, and then a whole bunch of periods, which makes me assume there are also more numbers in this list. Haven't seen something that rough since Kingdom Hearts. Near Replicant version 1.22474487139 is an updated version of Near Replicant, previously only released in Japan. Discover the one of a kind prequel of the critically acclaimed masterpiece, Near Automata. Now, with a modern upgrade, experience masterfully revived visuals, a fascinating storyline, and more. The protagonist is a kind young man living in a remote village. In order to save his sister Yona, who fell terminally ill to the Black Scrawl, he sets out with Grimmer Weiss a strange talking tome to search for the sealed verses. 
I think I said that all correctly. I don't know. See the world of Nier like never before. Uncover the truth behind the world of Nier and prepare to question everything in this dark, twisting tale. Exciting swordplay and powerful magic. Fight back dreadful enemies with a visceral, uniquely customizable blend of swordplay and powerful magic. A ruined world. Journey alongside an unlikely group of allies through a ruined world plagued by sickness and monstrous horrors. Sounds like modern day America. Experience multiple endings. Challenge your perspective and unveil the ultimate ultimate secrets hidden within multiple endings. Obviously not really a big Nier guy, I played a couple of minutes of Nier Automata, not really my kind of cup of tea, but of course for those that are wanting the never before seen, previously only released in Japan prequel of one of this past generation's biggest hits, then by all means you can check out Nier Replicant when it drops this week on PS4, Xbox One, and PC, and of course everything from this point on has been cross-gen compatible, so if you have a PS5 and an Xbox Series X, have at it. Before we go, we have some honorable mentions. First off, Smelter comes to PS4, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch. The Skylia Prophecy comes to PS4, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch. Moonrider comes to PS4, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch. And Dungeon and Gravestone comes to Xbox One and Nintendo Switch. But that rounds out this week's episode of The Drop. If you enjoyed today's show, drop me a like down below and let me know what games caught your eye. Are you picking anything up this week? Or if you're not, what have you been playing? Personally, over the past week, I've been digging into Dead Space on EA Play through my Game Pass subscription. Fantastic time, and it's really a bummer that I have not tried this game sooner. Runs incredibly well on the Xbox Series X, and that auto HDR truly makes those colors and shadows pop. You love to see it. But until next week, you guys have a fantastic one. I'll talk to you soon, and peace.